guys! How have you been? Hope you had a good Thanksgiving. I I tried to like force my mom not to cook this year because she has high cholesterol and I'm trying to make her eat healthy, you know? So I cooked Thanksgiving this year. More like I burned everything. Like there was literally smoke in the kitchen. So I ended up phoning Scott and I ended up spending um, Thanksgiving with her and her dad and my mom. Fail! So anyway, I'm having a bit of a predicament. Alex Argent came up with a completely unfabulous idea of having a secret Santa gift exchange thing for the pack, which sounded fun until the moment we picked names out of a lacrosse hat and I got Derricka. I mean, what are the odds? There's like ten of us. Couldn't I have gotten Isabel or... Scotty or Lyndon or even Jackie she'd be easy to shop for but no I have to get the one single solitary super grumpy alpha sour wolf who probably hates Christmas or me or both my life just never gets any easier so anyway Alex had a $15 budget so I'm gonna go to the mall and try and find something relatively Derricka esque let's see how that goes Well, that was a bust. As you can probably see, I couldn't pick something, so I just got everything. I've actually invited uh, Maddie Daler to come over and like film the shenanigans at the mall so I can show you guys. But by the time we were done, she was like, Ooh, my camera is looping. I'm sorry. Honestly, I don't even know why I bother being nice anymore. Like, I invite her out so that she's not the creepy loner in the corner with a camera, but at the end of the day, she doesn't really seem to care. So whatever. Honestly, I've got bigger problems right now. Um, the secret Santa thing is tonight, so I really have to make a choice pronto, and then head over to Lyndon's place where we're all gathering or whatever. So yeah, let me show you some of the stuff I got. First, a wolf hat. Woof. Or rather, a woof. Kind of looks like her, doesn't it? Because it's all black and. Anyway. Second. A wolf shirt. Actually, I have this theory that werewolves have this ultimate wolf form. Like, if you're really in tune with your wolfiness, you get turned into an actual wolf. Kind of like when we found Lawrence's body next to the Hale House. Sort of. So, yeah, and I'm pretty sure that if Derricka ever got to that stage, she probably needs to be all calm and zen for that, which <laughs> we all know she's not. Um, but I'm pretty sure that she'd look something like this. Plus, I really like all the hands around, like, kind of looks like the pack is giving her a hug. And she really needs hugs. Because she's a grumpy, grumpy wolf. Right, next. This is a bit of a humorous gift. Last time we were out on a mission quest punt thing, I was like, um, because she was like covered in dirt. So I was like, Derka, you really smell like death right now. And she really just sort of passed it through, like, we, we never really talked about it again, but I got her this, which is, oh, so it's perfume, but it's Kate Moss, should I be talking about Kate, should we even be mentioning Kate, right, so I guess that's not what I'm giving her, next, I got her a book, It's called I Want My Hat Back. It's basically a children's picture book, but it's hilarious. And I think this bear really is Derricka. Derricka in bear form. So let me show you. So the bear is looking for its hat. And he keeps asking various animals.
to see if um, anyone has seen his hat. So by the end, he's all desperate and sad because he misses his hat. And then he realizes. And I'm not going to spoil the ending for you because it's really, really funny. But yeah, basically, I think that if Derica ever lost her jacket and she went around looking for it, I think that she'd act exactly like this. So I got her this. I also got this DVD because, you know, there's vampires and werewolves and like hunters and it's ridiculously bad. It's so bad. It's actually good. Then again, the hunters, though, and the werewolves don't really end well, do they? Hmm. And sort of as a last resort type thing, I, I mean, it's not really a gift. It's more like I drew this the other day and I thought maybe So that's Derica, me, at Scott, and that's Alex and Isabel, and that's Lyndon and Jackie, and Veronica and Eric, and that's a Christmas tree, but we have a moon on top instead of a star because, get it? Werewolf pack! Yeah. I'm not sure she'd appreciate the grumpy face, but then again, it's accurate. So yeah, I mean, that's kind of everything. I really don't know what to do, like, I mean, the hat is a thing. Wolf hats are most definitely a thing, but I don't know if she'd like it. I don't know if she'd like the shirt either. Maybe the shirt? I think I've got it. I'm going to give her the book. And I will slip this in here. And then watch her face when she opens it. So yeah, thank you guys for joining me on this epic quest to find Derica a secret Santa gift. And um, I hope that you have a great Christmas. And I'll see you again soon. Thanks for watching. I just wanted to wish a very personal Merry Christmas to Holobax, previously Holoroden, who was my assignment for this uh, Teen Wolf Holiday Exchange thingy on Tumblr, uh, for which this video was made. I hope you like it, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, actually, I had a, quite a different thing in mind, but it didn't really work out because my group, because we have a cosplay group and we all do gender bent Teen Wolf. But my Derica is stuck in Sweden at the moment, so we couldn't actually do what I wanted to do. But we're still doing that at some point. Uh, so keep an eye out, maybe subscribe to this channel, and yeah, you'll get the update. Uh, again, Merry Christmas, both to Holoroden, Holobax, or the entirety of the Teen Wolf fandom. You guys have given me so much this entire year, and I love every single one of you, even if we've never spoken. Um, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, Happy Holidays, and I hope that wherever you are, you're smiling. Bye!